Hi, sexy ones. Are you aware that this month is sexual health breast awareness month? Uh, for me, it's always bringing sexual health in because if we are, you know, sexually appetizing our body, mind, and soul, we can bring it into our breast and bringing more positive outlooks and, and advice into our body, outside our body, and making it aware for so many other people. So my friend Laura really helped me 15 years ago before I even became Dr. Risa, the sexy sexologist, but I brought in Tap Your Tal Tulips Tuesday. So if you want to know more about what we are going to be talking about with breast health and sexy awareness, um, stay tuned, uh, subscribe, like, comment, share, and uh, yeah, I hope that you stay around to learn more about breast health and the X in S-E-X-Y. So Laura, I'm looking at her website. It's essentiallypink.com. She's an acupuncturist in San, San Diego, and um, she is a dear friend and really got me to be more aware of how we take care of our bodies. You know, we think about it and then we push it to the sideline. But when you make it a weekly thing and working on a masturbation orgasm tracker that I want to help you track everything, even when we're doing a breast massage on Tuesday, even when we masturbate and have orgasms. So this is a way, all of these steps that I teach are ways to uh, bring more happiness instead of fear into our bodies, mind, and soul. This month, we focus on health, not the disease of cancer. So let's bring more healthy habits instead of like, let's not be like looking at the negatives of it. So her message is breast cancer is way too popular. Science has proven that what you focus manifest, it's called law of attraction. Currently, the US focus is more on raising money to find a cure for cancer and researching better, stronger drugs to fight the disease when it strikes. Essentially, Pink is here to shift the paradigm, paradigm uh, and focus from a fear-based based finding cancer approach to a love-based approach that includes loving your body and breast health. While her strong desire to propose breast health and provide proactive ways to prevent disease. She has worked as an educator and counselor for the Best for Baby Project and Healthy Youth and Parent Program at the San Diego State Foundation. Observing the huge need for educators that not only promote health awareness, but provide proactive solutions. Don't you like this better than the fear-based way? Laura started the Masters of Science in Traditional Oriental Medicine Program at PCOM in 2003 and helped her friend and colleague Deb Davies with the integrative, the integrative medical discussion group uh, and talks about uh, the emotional connection to this disease, women's health and facial rejuvenation and is committed to making our communi community a healthier place. Breast health is important for every human being and especially African American lesbians because that they are at the highest risk for the disease. I just learned that. Essentially, Pink promotes breast health any, everywhere we get a chance. So that's why I'm talking to you about it. And the next one I want to talk about of the SEXY is the why. Why? Why are we doing this? You know? So the, the sorry, the X. <laughs> or should we talk about the why? <laughs> Let's do the why and then we'll come back to the X. The why, and I love this, because yes, on foods, what we eat, what kind of foods, the fiber, uh, you know, luckily during this time of the pandemic, a lot of people are learning sprouts. I've never done sprouts and we're going to do a YouTube and a TikTok on how to make sprouts. Would you like that? Or even maybe even chocolate, uh, uh, healthy edibles also. But what we are putting in our system and that includes with the MOT, if we smoke weed, if we eat the edibles, what we drink, the sodas, the kind of water we drink. Is your food organic? Is it really organic? Do you even know where it's coming from if you live in a big city? Are you just on the, on the fast track and you just pick up some nasty chips or Pringles or Doritos and think, oh, I'll just buy that apple there because you want to be healthy? We don't even think about it anymore. I know that I was eating bologna and icky cheese and not knowing really what it's from or hot dogs. If you really want to get to know what we're putting in our body and not wait until you get something, this is really nice habits. And so the MOT tracker talks about the food, the pills, the vitamins, the drugs, the illegal drugs, the prescriptions, whatever we put in our system, whatever we put on our body, this is the why. Why, what are we doing to keep ourselves healthy? So definitely watch all the other videos on um, 
breast awareness and sexual health and moving our bodies and our breasts through tap your tulips and the E, excuse no more, learning no more excuses and learning mantras and meditate and mindfulness. So um, remember, I am Dr. Risa, the sexy sexologist and subscribe, like, comment, share, tweet, uh, talk about it. Talk about orgasms and masturbating and orgasms because the more we don't hold on to it, the more we let go, the more we get to be our true authentic sexual self. Are you ready to be your real self? Uh, I know I am. Follow my journey. Love you sexy ones.